Hi ladies, welcome to this masterclass for female coaches and entrepreneurs. The five feminine foundations to build your empire. Today I'm going to walk you through the essential foundations I personally use to build a thriving global coaching empire and how you can implement them to scale to 10K months consistently with feminine grace and simplicity and no hustle required. In the masterclass today, here's what you'll learn. Why spending time on the non-profitable parts of your business will kill your energy. What it really takes to make consistent 10K months and the numbers you need to know. You'll learn the fundamental marketing strategies you need to fill your programs and make consistent 10K months and how to build and scale your business, focusing on your unique gifts and talents while making incredible money doing what you love. And also how to develop the mindset of a female leader so that you can build your empire with elegance and simplicity and, of course, without the hustle. So you are in the right place if you're a female coach, a consultant, a service provider, and you desire to build a freedom-based six-figure or beyond business. You've either started and making less than 10K per month or you're about to launch your business. You have a big mission in the world to make positive change with your unique gifts and talents. And you desire to build your business the smart way with solid foundations for growth and scalability. And you're looking to follow a leader who's built her business using simple feminine principles that support her lifestyle and her family. Now, being here today, my guess is that you're possibly experiencing some or all of the below symptoms. Perhaps you have no idea where to start to build your business and you're spending countless hours searching for the right answers. You might be overwhelmed by all the so-called experts online and find yourself opting in for opt-in after opt-in or webinar after webinar, yet still not sure what to do next. And if you are making money in your business, you're possibly finding it's inconsistent and you're always in hustle mode. You might be finding yourself working long hours without the financial rewards, and perhaps you feel like your business is more like an expensive hobby than an empire. So I wanna congratulate you to coming to this masterclass because if you're all here, it means that you wanna become what I call an influencer, someone who has impact in the world. And for me, I love to teach people how to become influencers more than just coaches and consultants because by doing that, you get to align to your authentic purpose. You get to change people's lives and unite the globe. You get to make a real impact and create a legacy. We're actually in an exponential state of change here on the earth and we need innovators and change makers to lead us. And I believe that's you. And you can also change your own life and, of course, those that you love by building this empire of change makers. And, of course, have an abundance of wealth for you and for others. So welcome for being here. So I am Janine Howard. I'm the CEO and founder of Iconic Empires. And I have actually led and scaled many multi-million dollar businesses uh, my career has actually been mainly in magazines, so as a publisher and an editor. So I've spent the last five, 15 years working with thousands of businesses in their sales and marketing and also hearing from entrepreneurs what their pain points are. I eventually then moved into coaching because I really loved helping people build their businesses. Um, being in a magazine environment, obviously it's stress and deadlines and pressure. So I have found that by building my coaching empire, it's allowed me to use my unique skills and talents for a business that does big things in the world. So I get to coach women across the globe, help them step into their feminine leader and also build their businesses. I have personally built three half a million dollar plus empires, uh, in two in magazines and one in my current coaching business, Iconic Empires. I've influenced and coached thousands to be their best selves and grow their businesses. And I have personally learned and worked from the globe's best coaches and experts. I truly believe in investing in myself and that then gets passed on to my clients. 
I've scaled uh, and grown my coaching business to 10K months within the first year and now multiple six figures. Now, my own story of transformation is that when I was in my peak of working magazines and being highly successful, I was anything but when you look at it from the inside out. I was an A-type personality, perfectionist, control freak, which meant I was often stressed. I was overworked and had daily anxiety. And in fact, my lifestyle was really unhealthy. And, you know, I actually had really some big struggles having children. Um, as you can see, my beautiful little girl, Frankie Grace there, she is three years old. And I also have a little boy called Jack and he's five. So it was during this really hectic, hedonistic lifestyle of magazines that, you know, I just really was struggling on the inside. Um, you know, on the outside, I was winning awards. I was had a very high profile. I was traveling the world getting lots of freebies and having what seemed like a really glamorous lifestyle. But underneath, I was really dying inside. So there came a point, in fact, when I finally got pregnant with my first baby, that I had a real awakening. And that was that there is so much more to life and that I could use the skills and talents that I had to develop not only a great business, but a lifestyle for myself and my children and my husband. Uh, to date, my husband has been able to retire from his job. He was actually working in the government and he is now a full-time actor and a film producer. Uh, I'm now, you know, really in, in tune with my feminine and spiritual leadership to build that global coaching practice. And now I lead other women to attune to their unique desires and talents and build an empire that supports their lifestyle. So welcome again, and let's dive into the training, the five feminine foundations to build your empire. So let's dive into feminine foundation number one. Feminine foundation number one is to create an offer that aligns with your unique gifts and talents that speaks to your soul aligned client's desires. So imagine this. Imagine working with clients that are eager to work with you and readily pay your fees. And imagine having your clients achieve extraordinary results from your mentorship and leadership. And imagine having your clients begging to work with you. Well, the reality is that most female entrepreneurs actually struggle to gain clients. In fact, four out of five coaches fail in the first three years. And many women I come across are suffering from burnout and fatigue from staying in hustle mode over prolonged periods of time. And many coaches and consultants are unable to make even enough revenue to be a viable business, like an expensive hobby. So if that's you, then stay with me in the training. Perhaps you've got a lack of clarity on your ideal client and niche, and you may be at a point of burnout and fatigue from stay in hustle mode. And perhaps you're even undercharging for your services. Well, here's my first step. You need to tap into your ideal client. You need to know your client as well as you actually know yourself. Now to do this, sometimes this is the hardest part when starting your business. Many women struggle with for year after year. In fact, when I first started my business, I kind of joked that I coached any woman in any business. And so what that meant is that I attracted all sorts of different women from different niches into my business, which was wonderful. But what it meant is I found it really hard to get traction because I was being a jack of all trades and master of none. So this might be you. And if so, I will say that you really need to tap into the one client that you feel so aligned with, that you know her pains inside and out, that you know exactly what she desires. And I will make this really simple for you, that she's probably you a few years ago. In fact, I have now really tapped into my ideal client, that she's exactly me when I was in that pain point of in between magazines and the coaching world, knowing that I really wanted to have a business that supported my lifestyle. Now, my lifestyle 
was to stay at home with my babies and to have my husband around and not do the nine to five grind. So for me, I found diving into a coaching business that was unique to me, my skills and talents, and that had a real femininity to it was exactly what worked for me. So therefore, that's why I'm speaking to you because you are no most likely very similar to where I was at that pain point, being overworked, stressed out, had anxiety, but knew she was due for something great in the world. So tap into your ideal client. Think about her pain points and her pleasure points. The next one is then to create really irresistible packages for that client, a package that absolutely solves one problem, your client's main problem. So let's use me as an example. So my main problem was I needed to replace my income that I had from my magazines with a lifestyle business. So I was really motivated to find a business that I could work in that was part-time, that wasn't in hustle mode, that allowed me to stay at home and have babies. Like I literally started my coaching practice when my son Jack was eight months old. And then when he was 16 months old, I actually was pregnant with my second baby. So, you know, I got to stay at home my last four years breastfeed my babies, nurture them, and at the same time, retire my husband from his, his job that he had that was, you know, working 70 plus hours a week. So design a package that your client cannot say no to. Solve that one unique problem for her and show her exactly how to do it. I'll give you an example of one of my clients that we've done this for. So Alana is a kinesiologist and she had just finished her training, but she was working in a corporate job. She was needing to replace that income with her own business so that she could really tap into her core essence and create solar line programs. And she now has those programs filled with her dream clients and she's running yoga retreats and workshops. And she's actually just come back from Bali for five weeks where she did some extensive yoga training. Now she would never have had that opportunity if she had not have created gorgeous packages that her clients really felt aligned to. So she needed to tap into herself first and foremost to see what her own pain points and desire points were and then create a package around those that spoke to her ideal clients. So that's my feminine foundation number one. Now it does sound simple, but what I will say again is that most female entrepreneurs get stuck on this point. Don't overthink this. It is you a few steps ago. Tap into what your heart and soul was desiring and the pain points that were keeping you up at night. And that's the soul aligned client that you'll be looking for and be able to tune into and create irresistible packages for her. Feminine foundation number two is learning how to sell high ticket programs authentically so that you can have clients invite themselves to work with you. Now, what I mean by that is that I see far too many female entrepreneurs undercharging for their services. So imagine being able to sell your services with confidence, being able to fast track to 100K in your business with simple strategies and knowing exactly what to say to have your clients say yes to working with you. And the reality is that When it comes to selling high ticket offers, many women suffer from the imposter syndrome, the who am I to charge this rate? And often we find that comes down to self-worth. The wondering about, you know, who am I that's different in the world? How am I unique? So let me tell you now, you are unique. Just who you are with your unique gifts and talents. And I will say too that charging high ticket prices means that you will have clients who have skin in the game. When I find that 
my clients, if they come on board with me and they're charging too little for their, for their services, we find that the clients they attract are not the right clients. Whereas if they actually have what I call skin in the game or high ticket sales, that client has a vested interest to make it work for them. They show up and they do the work and they're committed to making it happen for themselves. The rea reality also is that many female entrepreneurs unravel all their hard work in sales conversations because they're shy or don't want to be seen to be salesy or perhaps they think that uh, by asking for the money is somehow not in alignment to their sole work. Well, what I'll say to you, it's actually your obligation to offer your services to someone who comes to you looking for answers. It is your obligation to offer that service that you know will help them. So think about that when you're in that sales conversation, that it's not about you. It's always about your client. And the reality also is that many coaches and consultants have no strategy for dealing with objections or have follow-up systems in place. So you might be overwhelmed by the noise in the online marketplace and you feel you have nothing unique to offer or stand out. You may very well feel uncomfortable selling and you actually avoid having sales conversations. Or perhaps you're experiencing guilt or shame about your business if you get an objection. And then of course, that leads to failing into following those clients up. So my feminine foundation number two is to get crystal clear on your numbers. Think about this. If you're selling high ticket offers and it packages that are say two and a half thousand dollars plus, that's what my clients are selling. It takes less numbers to get to 10 K months. Now, Think about this, if your package is say $2,000 for perhaps a three month program, you only need to get five new clients a month to hit your 10K months. It makes sense, it's a numbers game. And I want you to think about your business in terms of simplicity. You know, when we're selling at low ticket numbers, you know, perhaps we're selling per the hour, $150 per hour. It's a long, long road to actually build up to that 10K months. And again, you're not really serving your clients because they're not in a container of support. I teach my clients to create really irresistible packages that have a container of minimum of three months to support their client through transformation. Because I know after working in this industry for many years that clients can't have transformation in less than three months. Uh, there's a psychology of what happens to a client when they go into that period of change and often they'll find that they have rapid transformation followed by a dive and you want to be there to support your client in that dive and help them back up through that real transformational period. So what my clients are doing are selling packages around $2,500, $3,500, $5,000 and more for three months or more. In fact, in our business, we really encourage our clients to have a six-month VIP program for one-on-one -on -one clients um, and then also an ongoing group coaching program that provides a really nice container for those clients. You want to really uncover your client's pain and pleasures. So I have a three-step method to selling with authentic authenticity and grace. And that is number one, find out your client's pains and talk to that. Number two, find out your client's pleasures and talk to those. And number three, show them the next step. So that next step might be getting on a phone call with you. It might be to come and join your program. Whatever it may be, it's a one, two, three step and it never changes, whether it's in your sales copy, whether it's in a Facebook post, whether it's actually in a sales conversation. It's always tap into client's pain, tap into client's pleasure, 
or desires and then show them the next step. And this is how I've always been able to sell with authenticity and grace because I'm talking to exactly what's going on for my clients. And I know that because my clients are me just a few years ago. And next to have a follow-up system in place. Again, we don't want to create an empire without the foundation. So by having a system that you must follow, that's part of your procedures, then it's easier to have, to actually put this into implementation. And I will say too, that the sale is in the follow-up. Many female entrepreneurs will fail in this area that they actually had someone who said no, but that person might be ready in three months time, six months time, or even a couple of years down the track. And if you're building an empire, you want to play the long game. So we teach our clients how to have an automated follow-up system so that they're constantly in touch with those people who expressed interest in working with them, but perhaps weren't in the right space to do it then. What you can also do and what we teach our clients is if their client's not quite ready for your package or program is to actually offer them a small taster. And that taster might be, you know, a two for one session just so it can get them in the door and start working with you at a smaller scale and seeing what results they get from that. And we find that there's a really big conversion rate from those tasters to then going into your programs or perhaps your one-on-one -on -one services. One of our beautiful clients, Melissa Lennard, and she is an interior designer and she came to us when she was working full-time in her uh, corporate job and she really had a desire to go out on her own. With our systems, she was actually able to drop down to four days in her job within just a couple of months she then actually moved out of her full-time job into her own business within the first year of coaching with us at Iconic Empires. And she is now on track for a million dollar turnover in 2018. So how she did that was she very much implemented step-by-step -step these feminine foundations. She learned how to sell packages that were perfect for her clients. She learned how to tap into their pains and pleasures, even in her interior design business. So you don't just have to be a coach. And she really worked out uh, a, a system that allowed her to deliver her services in a way that weren't taking a huge amount of her time. And then to implement these marketing strategies that I'll show you next without having to hustle. So feminine foundation number three is to focus on the money-making marketing activities that actually build your business month on month. This is an area that I see far too many female entrepreneurs neglect. In fact, if you've already started your business and you're feeling some of this, you may know that possibly working in your business more than what you are working on your business. So imagine actually working less while earning more. Imagine knowing exactly what activities to do every day and then being able to get them done really quickly and then either focusing on delivering service to your clients or being able to take time out for yourself. And also imagine having a business model that gives you a freedom-based lifestyle to travel the world and spend time with friends and family, just like I've been able to do. As I said, you know, we've been able to retire my husband. He gets to pursue his career as an actor in film, TV and on stage and also has his film production company. So he's often getting gigs, you know, all over Australia, um, sometimes overseas. And we as a family have the freedom and flexibility to actually to go with him because my business can be anywhere in the world at any time, as long as I've got my laptop. Literally, that's all I need. And obviously, Wi-Fi connection. But the reality is that most female entrepreneurs work more hours than a full-time job. Yes, ladies. 
and many coaches and consultants have no real strategy in place and therefore have a throw the spaghetti at the wall approach and hope for results. And many women enter their own business for lifestyle and freedom, yet they actually end up confused, stressed, overwhelmed and overworked. So is this you? Are you finding yourself working hard in your business and putting in hour after hour yet still not reaping the financial rewards? Or perhaps you're not even sure of what to do in your business and you end up being busy being busy. Or you go into hustle mode, build up the income, and then you go into breakdown mode or what we call the feast or famine cycle. So to build your empire, I like to start with your low hanging fruit. Often we have women start their businesses and come to us and say, I have no idea where to find my clients. Your clients are actually closer than you think. So my strategy, which is feminine and simple and an easy strategy is you actually offer out your services to your network. Now, we're not necessarily private messaging people or you know, harassing people to come and work with you. We actually put out elegant offers to trial your services. Now, if you've ever read the book, The Prosperous Coach, it's interesting, this was always my approach. And then I read The Prosperous Coach and went, hey, that's exactly my philosophy. I believe that if you offer out your service, like a, a taster, perhaps a, a 60 minute breakthrough session or strategy session with a client, you can actually walk them through a real, really powerful process that we um, give to our clients. We actually give them a script to walk them through a powerful process where that they'll actually come to you and ask to work with you because you've been able to demonstrate to them that you are there to solve their problem. So if you go back to feminine foundation number one, it's that one problem that you uniquely solve for your ideal client and then offer them an irresistible package or service that they can't say no to. Now, I'll tell you that over the years, my clients have continually come from people perhaps um, that I've you know, been in networking groups with who have you know, actually gone to high school with me. I've even coached people who used to work for me. So this is a client base that never stops referrals, word of mouth, you know, people who've already established and know you like, you trust you factor. But I'm going to show you in the next step that we can't just rely on that. Because if we do, that's where the hustle mode comes from, that it's not consistent. It's not a consistent way to rely on getting clients. You need to focus on money making activities before you do anything else in your business. So this is the area that many female entrepreneurs fall down in that they're spending too much time either in service mode or answering emails or updating their Instagram or making a website rather than really focusing on money making activities first and foremost every day in their business. So now I'm going to tell you what you really need to sell your services that is not a website. So after you've got your first few clients and the fastest plus part, sorry, the fastest path to cash is your low hanging fruit. The next thing you need to build, is an online sales funnel. Now we actually walk our clients through every piece of software, every system that they need to build an online funnel that attracts their ideal soul aligned clients consistently month after month after month. Now this system is the one that we've used to scale and grow our own business to multiple six figures without being in hustle mode all the time. So imagine being able to have your business working for you 24 seven a day and having client leads come into your calendar to speak with you week after week. This is a part that 
I've really seen so many women struggle with and it can be so simple if you're given the exact steps to do. Now, in my own business, I learned how to, you know, I took course after course and expensive program after expensive program of, of how to learn how to do this, but no one ever really showed me exactly what to do. In fact, we show our clients step-by-step -step what to do, which software platforms to use, and then we have support for you with our team of Facebook experts, copywriters, and sales funnel strategists to actually help you implement this system that then becomes an evergreen in your business. Now you do have to use Facebook ads for this method. It will work organically as well, but if you really want to scale and grow your business quickly to consistent 10 K months and then beyond, you do need to implement this system. And we show you that it's just one piece of really amazing content for your clients to really get to know you like you trust you and then want to work with you. So, there is one other strategy that you really need to nail in your business to build your empire. And we say you need three marketing strategies with two up your sleeve. So the three are your network. So that's the low hanging fruit. You then need your online marketing funnel. And then I love speaking and in-person events, whether they're your own or going to speak to other people's events. This has been a strategy that has worked time after time for myself and my clients. And it's something a little bit different that a lot of other people aren't teaching. And in fact, uh, just recently I made $50,000 just from two speaking events that cost me under $300 to deliver. So this is the three marketing strategies that we absolutely teach our clients and walk them through. And then we allow them a couple of other strategies up their sleeve that um, they may love doing themselves. So that might be content marketing platforms. So they might love to do a podcast or a TV series, you know, or summits, that kind of thing. And we allow them to do that too. And we do show them, but we do say you need these three marketing strategies of your network, online marketing funnel and speaking to really grow your empire. One of my clients that has had great success implementing these three um, strategies is Mandy. Now Mandy has actually been in her business for over 10 years before she came to work with us. Now within three months of working with us, she actually had her highest month ever. And she's actually now on track for multiple six figures. And prior to that, Mandy wasn't even reaching that 100K or six figure mark consistently. Feminine foundation number four is to implement the system strategies and processes that give your business rock solid foundations on which to scale and grow so that you get more freedom faster. Again, this is an area that I see many women really struggle with in their business that they're not setting up that empire foundations. So imagine setting up your business the right way so you can easily scale and grow. Imagine having a team that supports you so you can focus on your zone of genius. Imagine building a business empire that you can track, measure and implement strategies from a place of confidence. But the reality is that many female entrepreneurs set up their business more like a hobby. And this means their business takes much longer to scale and grow due to lack of cash flow and money management. And many coaches and consultants aren't business savvy and just want to serve, meaning they end up staying stagnant in their business for a long time. So if this is you, perhaps you want to start or you went into your business to serve others, but not to become a business manager. You aren't sure if you've set up your company the right way or even your bank accounts or tax and perhaps you aren't even able to think about outsourcing yet or trying to do all the tasks in your business yourself, including your books. So feminine foundation number four is to get your profits and paperwork sorted. This is the part that I find many women overlook in their business. 
So we fast track our clients and get them to know their profit margins. We help them track their expenses and we help them outsource what is not within their genius zone so that they don't stay stuck in their business doing all of the things that they shouldn't be doing and should have an expert doing. So if this is you or you don't know how to do it, don't worry, we give our clients templates and strategies and systems to be able to implement them really quickly so that they've got a really good foundation to scale and grow. And of course, it's about having the right team support. It's outsourcing to the right people. In fact, this is a massive area I see many women struggle with of not even knowing who to outsource to or what jobs to outsource. So we fast track our clients and actually have team members that can help them in that or show them who it is that they're meant to be using. And it's also about getting the right mentors who've walked in your shoes before. We see far too many women struggling for years, you know, trying to get their business to a point that is really bringing revenue that they need and creating that lifestyle for them. And it needn't be that way if you've got the right people in your team. So one of our beautiful clients, Yasmin, she actually started her business as a side hustle working in her corporate job. And she was actually able to go full time in her business just after a few short months. She is actually now on track for six figures in less than one year using these feminine foundations. Now, Yasmin has amazing future in front of her. We're just about to implement her online funnel for her. And interestingly, she was actually able to get to six figures using the first step, which was just her network and speaking. So you can imagine now that we're going to implement her online funnel that she's going to be able to scale and grow rapidly. And feminine foundation number five is to align to your inner feminine leader so that you can build your business from a place of power and certainty. Imagine having the mindset of a feminine leader and stepping into your innate power. And imagine operating a business that empowers you to truly live the life you desire. And imagine having full faith and alignment to abundance so you can break through your money ceiling and build a six figure plus business. And also imagine surrounding yourself with high vibe people to mastermind with and to support you and to show you what is truly possible. Well, the reality is that many female entrepreneurs play small and never fully step into their brilliance. Their business becomes a burden rather than a platform for their lifestyle and desires. And many coaches and consultants struggle with money blocks and self-worth issues that actually stop them from claiming their abundance, that they're worth and is due for them. Many women try to build their business alone and actually end up feeling isolated and then lose passion for their purpose. And that is what absolutely kills me when I see women who have such unique talents and gifts to share with the world, but because they haven't built their business on these feminine foundations, they get burnt out and lose that passion and end up, you know, possibly even getting health issues and stressed out from doing things the hard way and doing it in a masculine way. So is this you? Have you stepped, have you put off stepping fully into your business? Perhaps you're already working in a job and you're just waiting for the right time. You aren't able to even think about outsourcing yet. And you're trying to do all the tasks in your business yourself, including your books. And you have a belief that business will be hard work. And therefore, you actually attract the same energy back from the universe. And perhaps you're living with a lack mindset that's preventing you from gaining clients and money. So we teach our clients an abundance mindset. We actually teach them how to attune to the vibrational frequency to attract their ideal soul aligned clients. We teach our clients a range of modalities, how to rid themselves of money blocks, how to heal past traumas, how to attune themselves to a high vibration of a feminine leader that is able to easily attract both clients and money. We also teach our clients to be the woman they desire to be 
right now. In fact, this is the key to manifestation of building that beautiful business that you desire is to be and act like that woman right here, right now. Our clients have learned how to act like the six figure or the seven figure woman that they want to be right here, right now. And that's not just how in they dress, it's how they show up in the world. It's how they run their business as a feminine leader. It's how they have self-love for themselves. It's how they act on a daily basis to be able to live in a world that is truly aligned to them right here, right now, rather than having a business where they feel like they're constantly in masculine hustle mode. And one day they'll be that woman who has that six figure be that woman now. Ask yourself, who would I need to be if it was already mine? And we also show our clients that by surrounding yourself with a high vibe tribe of women just like yourself, who are really going for it to build that empire, has a massive impact on your success. By surrounding yourself with people who inspire you, who've gone before you, who also keep you accountable and show you what is possible is one of the major keys that we see to our client's success. We supply our clients with an environment where they can feel they can be vulnerable, that they can share, they can share their wins, they can share their fears and we show them quickly how to move through those fears to make it into a higher level of mindset that they can attract the money lifestyle that they're after. So it's all about being a feminine leader, just like our client Michelle did. Michelle uh, really developed a business that supported her lifestyle. Being a single mother, can, as some of you, if you're single mothers as well, can be really quite draining. It could be stressful. You feel like you're juggling family and business and constantly giving, giving, giving. Michelle actually found that the business model we helped her develop really supported her to not only be the best mother she could be, the best businesswoman she could be and always be in a place, a place of creativity, she was actually able to really serve herself, you know, and to um, be, give herself back the time for fitness, to give herself time to catch up with girlfriends, to travel the world, you know, to really experience the life that she desired and put her desires first and foremost and what that means is she's been able to create a six figure plus business within just a year of starting and a business that's really aligned to her and she gets to work with amazing clients. In fact, hotels around the world. So our lifestyle and business framework that we teach our clients is made up these five feminine foundations to build your empire. And this allows our clients to attract consistent leads of their soul aligned clients, enabling them to have a powerful business that supports them, their lifestyle, their families, to serve clients from their highest good and to make wonderful money while doing it. Now, if you've been listening to this training and you've started your business, but you're not seeing that consistent revenue, or perhaps you're ready to build your business and launch it, but really want to do it from the right way to start with, with the right foundations, we actually encourage you to look at developing this lifestyle framework in your business. So again, it's offers that solve your client's urgent problem. It's having high ticket offers. It's about building the business foundations of an empire, not just a hobby business. It's about focusing on simple money-making activities every day and stepping into your feminine power as a CEO of your business. And that's going to give you the freedom that you are really craving in this new energetic age that we're moving into with the earth. This is really a time that is there for you to step into that feminine leadership, to, to step into that 
divine inspiration that I know you have inside of you. There's actually never been a better time as a feminine leader to step into this. And what I will say too, is that don't worry about the, you know, thinking that everyone's already done it, that it's too late, that, you know, what have I got to give the world? This is the time now that the earth is ready for you to step into your feminine power and to be seen in the world as an influencer. And so if this training is speaking to you, I want to invite you to come and see what Iconic Empires is all about and how we can actually help you build a business that I've built for myself and we've helped our clients build for themselves. You know, learn learning from someone who's actually already done it. So created multiple uh, empires herself, <laughs> kind of an empire builder junkie. And I, I love helping other women build theirs because I've been able to quickly build a lot of them for myself. I've actually coached with the world's best. You know, I really invest in myself so that I can invest in my clients with the latest cutting edge techniques that are still so simple yet powerful and allow you to stay in your feminine. Someone who's dedicated to your success. You know, I'm more about helping my clients reach their goals than it is about me making money for myself. And and what you'll find is when you come from a place of service, the money always follows. And I found a real change in my business that when I really got out of my own lack mentality and my own fears about who I was and who am I and that imposter syndrome, that I really was able to have money then come flowing easily to me in my business. And the really important thing here that we do at Iconic Empires, which is a bit different to most other coaches, is we actually have a team that supports you. So a team of Facebook ed experts, copywriters, funnel strategists, all of the tech people and branding experts that can help fast track you in your business. So if you have just about to launch your business or you're struggling to make those consistent 10k months, I really encourage you to jump on a business strategy call with myself or one of my team and we will walk you through a strategy that's unique to you and your unique gifts and talents to build your own empire. So what I'll say is that sometimes you come to these calls and uh, these webinars or masterclasses and don't take action will be one of the five percenters who actually take action when it's given to you. And this is what I've been really proud of myself is I take action when it's been given to me. And that's why I feel that I've had so much success in my life is because when an opportunity is presented to me, I get over my fears, I get over myself and I take action. So ladies, if this training is speaking to you, if you really want to set the foundations for your own empire, whether it's as a coach or a consultant, and do it in a way with simplicity and elegance and real femininity, I encourage you to jump on a build your empire strategy call. Click on the button below. You'll be taken directly to my personal calendar and you'll either get on the call with myself or one of my team and we'll walk you through a strategy that will help you build the foundations for your business empire. So again, thank you so much for showing up on the, the masterclass today and well done on showing up for yourself and really taking the time out to build your business empire. And we look forward to speaking with you soon.